Disney's Multiverse. We've just had some very exciting news about two new animated series based on the DC Universe coming out. Batman, Caped Crusader, and My Adventures with Superman. Both of which look incredible. Batman, Caped Crusader in particular is being show run by the legendary Bruce Timm of Batman the Animated Series, J.J. Abrams, who's currently involved in the new Superman movie, and Matt Reeves, no less. The director of the upcoming The Batman, if you didn't know already. My Adventures with Superman looks a bit more lighthearted but not quite the Teen Titans Go Justice League action style of light-hearted comedic fare. It just looks a bit more fun, but still a Superman show. Not as insane as the Aquaman King of Atlantis show that's been announced. It's all well and good, and we are definitely very excited for both of these projects, particularly the Batman one. But we have to ask the question, why just Superman and Batman? Yes, we know we're getting an Aquaman show. We also have Teen Titans Go, Justice League action, DC Superhero Girls, the these are all good, but they are also all comedy stuff. Why is there not a Wonder Woman animated series? This is another Superman animated series, this is another Batman animated series, and both look very good and I'm excited about both, but why is there not a Wonder Woman animated series? If we're just talking the DCEU, she's currently the only member of the Justice League to have a movie with a direct sequel starring just her, and she is the DCEU character who has appeared in the most movies. Even with the Suicide Squad included, Harley Quinn's appeared in three movies, Batman's appeared in three movies, Superman's appeared in three movies, Wonder Woman has appeared in Batman v Superman, Wonder Woman, Wonder Woman 1984, and Justice League. And yet she has not yet ever had her own animated series. She's appeared in other animated shows, such as Justice League, where she was fantastic. Why has she not got her own animated series so far? You could get Susan Eisenberg back to play as her. She was fantastic in Justice League and the Injustice series of games, and we'd be very happy to have her back. Alternatively, you could have Stana Katik, who just did a fantastic job in Justice Society World War II, which was an excellent film, and we'd certainly love to see more of that Wonder Woman. We'd be very happy for a spin-off of that as a full series. Now we completely understand why DC and Warner Brothers keep on going back to the Superman and Batman wells. They are their most popular heroes but Wonder Woman is a close third. She's the biggest female superhero in the world and she's a member of the DC Trinity and the only member of the Trinity not to have her own animated series. She's had one TV series back in the 70s and until then she had pretty much nothing other than appearances in other people's shows or in team shows like Super Friends or Justice League never her own thing until Wonder Woman the movie which was massively popular so why haven't DC capitalized on this Harley Quinn's got her own show Aquaman's got his own show Superman and Batman have had multiple shows Green Lantern has had his own show The Flash has an incredibly popular CW TV show even if he hasn't got his own animated show yet why hasn't Wonder Woman had her own animated show yet getting two new great DC animated series should not not be cause for concern. I am excited for both, as I hope I'm making clear, but I'm just angry that we are not getting a Wonder Woman animated show when she is the most popular female superhero in the world. Why are we getting Batman and Superman again when Wonder Woman needs some representation? Well, Batman Cape Crusade looks fantastic. I am still not sure about my adventures with Superman. It looks quite fun, but would I take that over a Wonder Woman animated series? No, I wouldn't. But why not? Why aren't we getting a Wonder Woman? series in the wake of the popularity of the movies I have no idea all we can theorize is that whoever is in charge of green lighting these shows doesn't think that girls are interested in a Wonder Woman show or boys either that's usually the case it's a real cliche but it's still one that is prevalent the idea that little girls do not want to watch a show about Wonder Woman and little boys only want to watch male superheroes this is despite DC superhero girls doing really well this is despite She-Ra doing really really well. Also let's not forget Harley Quinn which is admittedly a more adult show but it's a fantastic one nonetheless and is doing really well. HBO Max is a streaming service for all ages and all ages will be interested in a Wonder Woman show for the same reason that they're interested in Wonder Woman in the movies. So what am I saying with this? HBO Max give us a Wonder Woman animated series. I'm excited for both of these. I'm excited for the likes of Young Justice. I'm excited for Harley Quinn. I'm excited for pretty much anything apart from Aquaman King of Atlantis. Most of all, I want to see Wonder Woman, the animated series, and 
I know I'm not alone. What do you guys think? Are you excited about these projects? But do you really want a Wonder Woman show too? Let us know in the comments below. Let HBO Max know via Twitter or other social media. And maybe we will actually get a Wonder Woman show, finally. For now, thanks for watching folks. Please like, share and subscribe. It all really helps me out. And if you want to chat about this, you can either do so in the comments below or join us on the Inside the Multiverse Discord server, which you can find a link to in the description below. And please check out other videos on DC Comics Gamer. We've got a lot more on the back man justice league and some really cool videos on wonder woman 1984 as well as how to get her golden armor in lego dc supervillains for now thanks for watching and multiverse out